How's it guys? Ruby here. Welcome back to um, another reaction video where today we're going to be reacting to the um, the season 14 Brawl Talk. Um, it's crazy to think that it was two months ago since we reacted to season 13 where we saw um, where we got introduced to um, Otis. And uh, now we're already on season 14. Um, I am pretty excited for what so you know, I'm store. I have heard rumors that this is gonna be like an update where they like they like give revamps like remodels like the the ro the like robot enemies and like um Robo Rumble and Boss Battle and all that. But um I mean I am I mean I've only heard rumors, but I mean it is basically called Robot Factory. Yeah, but um anyways enough yeah, of that here we are. Hey Paula Oh my god, Danny's a replacement for a robot! Miss Danny Tron 3000. Oh. A genius robot I developed myself, capable of presenting any other thing. I see. Good job, Danny. Welcome to Brawl Talk. I'll be back. Yeah, because uh, I saw in the teaser trailer, there's a teaser image that it was Bell. Oh, and they were Oh, who's this guy? Is this a new guy? He's like a fisticuffs kind of guy. That's sick. I just got a notification. Back to the Wild West, but not entirely. Yeah. We introduced you to the Robot Factory, the robot. home of all those crazy robots you see in car park. It's also a perfect link to our newest chromatic brawler, Sam. He's the second Sam. member of and victory her partner in crime. He also has some personal beef with all the robots in car park. Mm. His playstyle feels very unique to Brawl. When equipped with his knuckle busters, he does a stronger close range I do apologize that there might be like slow down in this video. Time. Why? Because it's like premiering and I'm not. not as powerful, but they are faster. And while he has his knuckle mm. busters, his super bar is always full, meaning he's the first brawler who already starts with his super available. Oh. Activating his super with his knuckle busters on will throw them and will damage everything on their way. He also gets a temporary speed buff. Activating the super again will then call his knuckle busters back to his car and damage everything on their way back. While Sun doesn't have his weapon, he'll mm -hmm. have to charge his super in the normal way by hitting his attacks. Or mm -hmm. he can collect his knuckle buster mm -hmm. again. Sam will get the Caesar Sam skin at the Caesar last Caesar Sam! <laughs> King of the is Desperado, Poco. Desperado Poco. I was wondering what that Poco is. I called. I just called it like heavy metal Poco. Lola's Lola as the power Lola's Lola. Crow Bone. Moon Bunny Squeak. Dog Spam. <laughs> Mecha Mortis. That is sick. You get his spray profile picture and a whole set of his things for free. You're sick! Also, it unlocks two color variations in the shop for 49 mm. gems each. And lastly, mm. Trick or Treat Leon, which will be available on our Halloween. Oh, yeah. I was wondering what they would do for Halloween skin, but they got a Leon. And speaking of skins, other robots... Uh, the, the robots... There we go, guys! Okay. Yeah. The and robots got a rework, remodel. Like, we'll be getting another awesome 3D animation to feature pen and Apeed. And to celebrate that, we'll be getting a new PV mode. In this mode, you must keep Abit alive by collecting coins across the map and protecting him from the waves of bots. Okay. If Abit is defeated, you lose the game. If you and Abit survive until the end, you win. In this mode, Abit will be a walking around and doing some work. So we'll be in a team of four. But also make sure you always have him in your side. Interesting. You can swap brawlers in Power League. At the preparation screen, you can either request or receive a request to swap a brawler. And if everything looks great, you can accept it. That could be a really good idea to secure a good brawler first, or if they are just better than you with that brawler. Alright, interesting. We'll have a second brawler which will be released later second brawler. in September. Gus is a very weird kid with PJs and looks like he hasn't touched grass for a while. But besides his catchy vibes, Gus is actually a support brawler with the ability to heal and protect a life. For every attack Gus hits, he charges a new bar. Once this bar is full, the next attack you hit will drop a ghost in the map. Oh. If your allies touch this ghost, they will heal. You can drop multiple ghosts in the map. With his super, he 
is able to cast a shield either on his allies or on himself. To cast it on allies, you should aim and hit your shot. To use it on yourself, you just tap the super button as if you would be auto aiming. And great news, if you look forward to unlocking him, he will be super rare, which is quite... He's a super rare brother. Ah, oh, that's cool. Trophy reset is getting I was kind of hoping we get a new, uh, like a, a new, um... We are partnering with some Rare Broad. Awesome Super Rare is cool. And you'll be able to support them too by getting yeah, some picture or in the sense. New challenges Rare and quests, new sprays and profile pictures Ooh. and rewards. Ooh. The Robot Factory environment is also available in Showdown. New gadgets for fun and free. Here's new gadgets? And a message from the future. We managed to travel in time and get Frank from the future to tell you a bit more about what we have planned for Broster in the future. Sorry, not sure if you guys can hear it. Uh, sorry if you guys hear a washing machine in the background. Uh, anyway. Okay, I, I, think that's, I can't read. Uh, this is the first time ever we are talking about our future plans with you, our players. Yeah. Why are we doing this? We feel there's a disconnect between you and us, and we'd like to resolve it. So, let's talk about the next update. What about the new Frank skin? Yes, Super Soul Mate, what about that? We didn't plan to make changes to the system this year, but we understand your feelings and frustrations about it, and we share most of them. Consequently, we have decided to prioritize this and push back other changes. In fact, we're going to make some changes already in this update. We reduce the cost of from years and gear levels by about 50. Yeah, sorry. In the coming update, we are reducing the amount of rewards for and So, should we talk about October a little bit? We're going to simplify the flow on how you acquire gears and decrease the cost. And at the same time, we're going to introduce additional, more specific gears. Which oh, yeah, I heard about this. They were going to... Maybe 50 percent off. We did price of gears by 50 percent. I'm sorry. I'm probably gonna have to like rewatch this because I'm not paying attention. Um, Kairos. Ah, oh, Kairos time. Story mode or something? Almost like a place where we'll be able to tell a story in the future. We also have plans for Are we finally gonna get like an adventure mode in Brawl right. Stars? The timeline becomes a bit more uncertain at this point. However, there are a few bigger topics we would like to tackle. And the first one is affecting the current progression system and its reliance on money. You know what I found about Brawlers. We would like you to have more say in which brawlers you unlock and when, as well as which brawlers you would like to upgrade. These changes have a huge impact on how brawlers played. We'll give every player a clear goal of the game. We'd like to get these changes into your hands as fast as possible. And there are more things mm -hmm. that he's working on. Yes, we would like to make it more meaningful to improve playing certain rules. The concept of fast play. Think clearer goals, rewards, you get it. Additional items are now included this on things to do. Our matchmaking, better sense of collecting cosmetics, and more ways for you to show them off. As well as tools for you to share cool moments in the game on social media directly from within the game. We'd also like to introduce ways for you to recruit your friends. And yes, in parallel we've started working on a system to report other players for things like replay. We're likely going to roll this one out rather sooner than later and start the process of collecting data and get a sense of the volume of reports. This isn't a complete list of everything we'll do, but these are the topics currently taking the majority of our focus. I still can't get over the stonks, Pam. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. New and gold skins. And gold and giveaways. Yes. Bunny squeak. Brawl Stars creators do be giving away moon bunny squeaks. So search for hashtag bunny squeak giveaway. Here this on is YouTube like the yeah, Octofang giveaway. And read the rules cool. to participate this in the like giveaway. This is like the new year. And this isn't a list. <laughs> I did it perfectly before. <laughs> I oh. remember. <laughs> and if everything looks great for you, you can. I guess <laughs> <laughs> supernatural. <laughs>
Hasta la vista, baby. I'm better than Danny at everything. R2, G2 sounds. <laughs> Should I do it? <laughs> okay, um, that's, uh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. Well, um, I only understood, like, half of what was going on. <laughs> right, but, uh, yeah, from what I could pick up, we got a new environment, Robot Factory. We got two new, getting two new brawlers. We got Sam for the brawl path, and we got Kit named Gus. It's for some, it's coming later. And gears are getting a rework. Uh, robots have remodeled. And I uh, think they said Buzz and Griff were going to get new gadgets, which thankfully that was one thing I was hoping for. And uh, they're going to get a new, we're going to get a new animation, which will like be like a preview for like a new mode, new game mode. So um, that'll be cool. And uh, a bunch of other stuff. So um, yeah, well, this reaction was a, a little bit of a train wreck, I will admit, but, uh, you know, sometimes that's just how it be. Maybe I should probably have waited until this came out and then, like, you know, go react to it. I, I feel like I should have did that, but I wanted to be the one of the first views to see it, but, um, yeah, well, what are you gonna do about it? So, anyways, that, um, that'll do for the, today, guys. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like down below, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you don't miss an upload made by me. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.